योर क्वेश्चन इज रिप्रेजेंट ऑन अ ग्राफ द फंक्शन वॉट दे हैव गिवन एफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर थ्री एक्स माइनस सेवन फॉर जीरो लेस देन इक्वल टू एक्स लेस देन इक्वल टू टू एंड फॉर सेकेंड दे हैव गिवन टू लेस देन इक्वल टू एक्स लेस देन इक्वल टू फोर एंड फाइंड द रेंज नाउ फर्स्ट वी विल फाइंड आउट द डोमेन डोमेन आर द वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स तो फर्स्ट इज योर डोमेन तो वी कैन से डोमेन्स आर फॉर फर्स्ट वन दे हैव गिवन जीरो लेस देन एक्स लेस देन टू दैट मीन जीरो वन एंड टू जीरो वन एंड टू and for second one they have given two less than equal to x less than equal to four that means two three and four two three and four now just substitute this x values they are the values of x one by one in our functions what we will get तो फर्स्ट वी विल गो फॉर दिस थ्री माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर एफ एक्स इज इक्वल टू थ्री माइनस एक्स स्क्वायर नाउ टेक एक्स इज जीरो एक्स इज इक्वल टू जीरो दैर फोर यर वॉट विल गेट थ्री माइनस जीरो स्क्वायर दैट इज इक्वल टू थ्री नेक्स्ट टेक वन So you will get x is equal to one. Here you will get three minus one square. That is equal to what two. Next x is equal to two. Here you will get three minus two square. That is equal to we can say three minus four. That is minus one. Now the coordinates of this one. is what that we have to write the coordinates are you can see 0 comma 3 next 1 comma 2 next 2 comma minus 1 now we will go for 3x minus 7 So now we can say f x is equal to three x minus seven. Now substitute this value. Second one two three and four. What we will get? X is two. So so f x is what you can see three into two is six six minus seven. Six minus seven. That is equal to minus one. Next, x is equal to three. Three into three is nine. You will get nine minus seven. That is equal to two. Next comes your x is equal to four. So three into four is twelve. Twelve minus seven. That is equal to five. Now write the coordinates. What are the coordinates? You can see the coordinates are what two comma minus one, three comma two, four comma five. So these are the coordinates. Now we will draw a graph. They have told represent on a graph. So we will draw the graph. So here you can see in y minus one is there maximum and five is the maximum minus one is the minimum and five is the maximum and in x you can see four. So like that only we will make it. So here comes your like this. x is your maximum is 4 so we will go for that only this is 1 this is 2 this is 3 and this is 
this is phi this is your x axis comes to your y so here it comes one next is your two next comes your three next comes your four here comes your five this is your y axis this is your y dash and this is your x dash now in y dash also we got a number that is your minus one you can see minus one so here comes your minus one now just we will go one by one zero comma three first so zero comma three is where you can see zero and three is here so this is your zero comma three second comes one comma two so this is your one and this is your two it comes here so this comes your one comma two next comes two comma minus one two is here minus one is here so it comes here so it is what two comma minus one again so this is your first functions so just we will draw that so it will come like this second one two comma minus one is the same point three comma two three is here two is here this one so it comes here so this is your three comma two next is your four comma five so this is your four and five will come at the top here so this comes 4 comma 5 so now just join this the graph will come like this you can see that so we have represented that now what they have told you can see this find that edge that means from where to where the y axis will go that we have to write it that is your range now we can say range is you can see y axis 3 is here 2 is here and minus 1 is here so minus 1 is your the minimum point after that it's increasing both side therefore we will write minus 1 less than equal to fx now less than equal to now we, we should get a maximum in y so maximum is 5 you can see here 5 2 minus 1 2 and 3 that means 5 is here so here we will write 5 range a b is your this one 